This visual method statement will explain, procedure for erection and inspection of form work. We will cover the following contents in this video. Purpose and scope. Responsibilities. Tools and equipment. Erection and inspection. And references. The purpose of this method statement is to provide general guidelines for, erection and inspection of form work, at site and scope covers the form work activities on all projects. Responsibilities of project team includes as following, project manager, overall responsible for ensuring the activity completion as per approved drawings and applicable standards. Site, or construction manager, site monitoring, coordination with related staff, control of all the construction's activities related to the form work. Site Engineer, directly involved in the planning and execution of the activities involved in the formwork and shuttering works, preparation of the shop drawing, application for work permits, if required prior to commence formwork or shuttering works. QC Engineer, ensuring and monitoring formwork erection and inspection. All activities to be executed as per client requirements, procedures, PTS, approved IDPs, and MOS. He will submit RFIs to consultant and arrange inspection for getting approval. Foreman, responsible to execute activity of installation as per IFC drawings and approved MOS. Safety officer or safety in charge, responsible for ensuring best health and safety practices across working, storage areas, and during equipment operations. He must prepare risk assessment for effective controls. Following tools will be required to perform this activity, cutting disc grinder, jack saw, hammer, pin or nail puller. Erection and inspection procedure for form works will consist of the following activities. Form work and shuttering shall be positioned to correct lines and must be in plumb and level conforming to shape, lines, elevations and dimensions of concrete shown on the IFC drawings. Chamfer strips of 20 mm shall be used on all exposed edges as shown on IFC drawings. This video clip will illustrate, how to install chamfering edges in form works. When form work will be removed, these chamfering edges will make a permanent edge of concrete structures. Support and brace all forms adequately to maintain the desired position, during and after the placing of concrete, and build sufficiently tight to prevent mortar leakage. Position forms accurately to tolerance and firmly secures anchors, bolts, inserts, supports, hangers, pipe sleeves, drains, water stoppers etc. before concrete is poured. Fix foam and tape to all formwork joints and edges to prevent the loss of cement slurry. Apply oil on the surface of plywood to help easy removal of forms after concrete. Protect loss of water through the form work, by sealing the joints with tape and foam. Oil the shuttering and blockage of holes should be done, before fixing the reinforcement and concrete pouring. Surface of wooden plywood forms must be flat without any undulation. Shall be well clean and applied with oil. Comply with the following requirements. Formwork material shall conform to ACI 347R and shall be of wood, steel, 
driven sheet piling or other approved by client or consultant. The type, size, shape, quality, and strength of the material of which the forms are to be made shall be consistent with the specified finishes and safety. Formwork shall be strong, stable, and rigid to withstand the load of the fresh concrete during the pouring and to keep or maintain its position and shape. Surface of wooden plywood forms must be flat without any undulation. Shall be well clean and applied with oil. Please refer to following documents regarding this activity. Inspection and Test Plan, IDP. Quality Control Procedure for Identification and Traceability. Checklist or SOP1. IFC Drawings. Project Technical Specifications. ACI347R, Guide to Formwork for Concrete. This animated video is an illustration of the process of steel formwork erection and removal after concreting. It will show how a specifically designed formwork is strong and time effective in achieving the concreting plan for any project. Properly designed steel plate are assembled with formwork accessories, nuts, and bolts. These are designed as per the dimensions of the projects, to fit in a single floor area for all vertical units and slab bottom. Strongly fastened, this steel formwork will act a unit during concrete pouring, and will not displace even with high vibrating efforts. This way, contractor can concrete a reinforced concrete structure for a complete one level, at one time. This will impart integrity to structural elements. And construction progress can be achieved in day rather in a month. Thank you for watching. We hope this work methodology will be useful at site.